Yes, man, uh, Dave was a good, good old friend of mine. We worked at Four City Worldwide together at my shack. Uh, the transceiver I'm using now, which is the Alinco DX70, uh, which is one of my first uh, portable uh, radios. And uh, I bought it in Dayton, Ohio, 2002. And uh, he was the one who asked me to pick it up because it was in the flea market area. I saw the radio and before I uh, paid for it, I asked his advice and he told me go ahead and take the radio. Uh, it had no microphone, it was a uh, brand new radio. <laughs> Uh, I got it for uh, 200. The guy was asking 300 bucks. I uh, offered him 250 for it. Oh, uh, 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 good job, good job. Uh, but we might have one of those. Yeah. Uh, is, is that like? Uh, is it getting more power? Doesn't that put out a, a lot more power than the helicopter? Ah, uh, yes. It's 100 watts, and uh, it has a knob. Uh, one button. Uh, you press it in for low power. Runs 10 watts. Oh. Okay. So uh, you want the 100 watts position? Say again? Uh, how much watts are we putting out right now? Uh, 10 watts on. Uh, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's 5.9. It's 5.9 on top of your 10 watts. Yeah, USL and uh, the Alinco DX70 in uh, memory of my good old friend, uh, K3, uh, name of uh, Paul. Uh, so, uh, where have you been? I haven't had him on in a while. This is, uh, uh, the first time in a, a while. First time in a while. <laughs> I think you're losing it all. Okay, when's the last time you've been on? The last time I spoke to you was uh, about uh, two or three days ago uh, when I was at the beach uh, in my rocking chair in the sand, over. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Two, three days ago, right? Two or I think it's more like three days ago, right? I we can always see you on in the booth. Yeah, and every time I'm on the fan, I'll clean around and I'll hear you on or watch the pan adapter and uh, or in the disaster and see your signal. So I've been on two three days now and I haven't seen it in the cluster or anything. I said, Hey, I wonder what happened to Ernie. He said, uh, it's always always uh, at the beach there, though. Well, I'm always on and I was there yesterday. I made a hundred contacts yesterday. I was there day before I made 40 contacts. I was there the day before that and I made 47 contacts. So I have been there. Huh? Uh, okay, all right. I don't know. Uh, will you come on later or what? I think you were too busy going around looking for my kite, over. Uh, <laughs> Good one, Ernie. Good one. Wow. Yeah, uh, me and uh, the team station, we were uh, planning on uh, how we were going to send it. <laughs> yep, yep. My crystal ball is working, man. Huh? Wow. Wow, we must have just jumped up there. So, uh, wow. QSL. But you know about the special event I'm running today, right? So now you have your friend. Uh, yeah, so let's not, I don't want, I'm not going to hold you. Uh, let's just get back and uh, run your special event. I just wanted to say what's up. And uh, happy new year. I have to, uh, I, I, like I said, I haven't heard you because I guess you're right. I've been busy and uh, haven't had a lot of time. Oh, and, uh, and, and hold on, I got a phone call. No problem at all. No problem. <laughs> Victor Echo Free Echo Papa Sugar, J69 Zulu Stroke, K3 Lima Papa Special Event in memory of my good old friend Dave Collinan. 
who uh, passed last year, the 5th of January, uh, going to his backyard, uh, trying to save his dog, and he went through his eye and uh, to the eyes. J69 Zulu stroke K3 Lima Papa.